on the 22nd anniversary of the terror attacks on parliament today a major security breach has been reported mind it a security breach not a terror attack and in fact cnn news 18 was first to break this that this entire incident was a security breach and not a terror attack in fact this is what the top intel sources are maintaining when it comes to this entire incident well the entire incident happened both inside the parliament and outside the parliament four people have been detained in this very incident two from inside the parliament and two from outside the parliament first let's talk about the people who have been detained from outside the parliament well the two one is the male and another one is a female one is said to be neelam and the guy is said to be a mole and in fact both of them have been taken to the parliament street police station here in new delhi district and both are being questioned by the delhi police and in fact special cell has also reached this very police station and in fact two people who have been two males uh, have also been arrested and in fact been detained by the police who were actually uh, seen uh, burning uh, the uh, smoke bomb, in fact a yellow smoke bomb inside the parliament premises. Those two have also been detained by the police officials. Their name uh, is said to be Manoranjan and Sagan. In fact, all these four are said to be not known to each other. In fact, so there is no sort of planned conspiracy which we can say as of now. In fact, investigation has been launched. In fact, multi-role agencies, multiple agencies are actually currently probing this entire case. One thing is clear that this is definitely a big security breach which has been reported at the parliament. In fact, on the same day when 22 years back, that horrific terror attack took place on the parliament building. Well, this raises a lot of questions and raises a lot of eyebrows when it comes to the security protocol both near the parliament and inside the parliament because those two people were able to sneak inside that very canister and in fact two people as per the member of parliament because member of the parliament were the first one to actually get hold of these very people who actually came inside Lok Sabha and in fact burned that very smoke bomb. In fact, as of now, uh, different teams of Delhi police, be it the special cell, be it the district police, all are active in this case. In fact, the forensic team has also reached the spot where they are ascertaining exactly what was used in those uh, uh, very smoke bombs which were actually seen being ignited inside the building of the parliament. What the top sources are also indicating is that, yes, this is no terror activity, but uh, these four were protesting against the authorities uh, pertaining to the issue of price rise, unemployment and other related issue. As of now, these four people who have been detained by the police are from different areas and in fact are being probed by the police. In fact, not only being probed because they have to, the police officials have to ascertain uh, what was the exact motive behind this thing and, and exactly why this incident took place. In fact, uh, like I mentioned, this raises a lot of eyebrows uh, when it comes to this major security lapse inside the parliament because parliament is one of those high secured buildings in the country. In fact, there is a three level layer of security which is put in place when it comes to entry of any person inside the parliament, be it a parliamentarian or being a journalist or any outsider who wants to get inside the new parliament building. Well, as of now, things have calmed down a little with Om Birla coming out and speaking to the parliamentarians, parliamentarians and in fact giving out an assurance that a thorough investigation will, done, will be done in this entire case. As of now, what we can tell you that this is no terror attack but a major security breach.